Good morning, everyone. Sunday, Sunday the 5th of March, a beautiful sunny day. It's going to be a hot one, 32 apparently. Out on an early morning walk to beat the, the sun. Not real early, but early enough. It's only about 20 past 8. It's a beautiful tree again. And everything's going fine with Hogan. That's the house. Of, that's... Yeah, he's got the house with the chickens in the front yard. He loves them. Yeah. And he doesn't have... show. He doesn't show any aggressive. Any aggression? To pigeons or the chooks, which is good. We don't want him to be nasty to other animals. He just has a look at them, and uh, yeah, he's a good boy. Very good boy. There he goes again, I love that. <laughs> Anyone out there tell us why he does that? Is that a dominant thing or is that just because he's happy? I think that's a happy kick, yeah? The happy dance? The happy scratch. The happy scratch. <laughs> oh, he's so cute. Yeah, no dramas. It was a hot day yesterday too, so we couldn't go out for our afternoon walk. Way too hot. Like I said, he's got pink skin, a lot of pink skin, especially on his nose and one eye. It's very quite protective of him in that way. And also, who, who, who wants to walk on a really hot ground without shoes, you know? So you've got to keep that in mind. I see a lot of people walking their dogs in hot weather, hot, sorry, hot weather. And, um, and I think to myself... You've got shoes on, but the dog hasn't. How does that work? Like, they've got no concern for the poor dog. Anyway. Anyway, it just makes me... It pisses me off, actually, but... But we don't do that. That's what I'm trying to, trying to say, is be aware of that, folks. Hot ground is not good for dog's paws. What you doing? Wherever you are, whatever you guys are doing, whatever time of day it is, hope you have a great, great day, great afternoon or great night. And so sorry, that was a bit of a. There he goes again. <laughs> hope you have a great, great one. Bye for now from Ray, Sophie, and Hogan.